we back in the shop, man. I got a head start, had a lot going on, I couldn't even record. But it's all good, it's never too late. Still this joint, man. Got this thing coming along, almost finished. I went ahead and put the cam cover on there. Took the transmission cover off so I could switch that cable. Got that going. Got this thing on the road. My boy just pulled up with this joint, just gave me some parts. I just went ahead and installed this headlight, the uh, actual bezel. Now this thing looks a lot much better. You haven't noticed this bike have a lot of chrome from the PM brakes, floorboards, covers, transmission. He even has all chrome Allen, so it's my dog. We actually got the same birthday, but I was telling him I'm about to lace him up with the washers and throw him on this joint. So y'all gonna see it come to life. I'm about to be sliding. Man, got everything PM'd up. It's looking amazing. But yeah, man, this thing is looking I just good. Just went ahead and took the exhaust off so I could do the same thing, switch this clutch line out. He had gotten a little mini accident, but you already know if there's Dre, there's a way. We're gonna take these old clutch lines off, replace all that. Also, we're gonna replace this brake line. This one is super dirty, but it's not even. I made my boy go a uh, single disc, so we won't need that. Also, we're gonna put the new throttle cables. That headlight looking good. But yeah, man, he just pulled up and gave me the wheels. Now these was already on there, but these are definitely looking a lot much better with that single disc, baby. You see what's going on. Look at that, man. Good. That single disc looking amazing. Back yeah, man, we about to have that thing coming together. Just gotta throw in a few of these little pieces. Got the back light bar. These are the cables right here. Got the bags. So we sliding. We're waiting on to get his music uh, done. I've never been a scooter. Scooter has done a lot of people music that who I didn't roll with, and that dude does an amazing job. I just recently found out his son is doing it. So my boy, we for sure trying to get his bike to him so he can get that on the way. As soon as we finish it out of the shop, we're going straight to the dyno. So that's going to be happening like that. Like I said, we just basically doing a small Everything thing. Basically new from the old stuff that's damaged like that. We got the new console we're going to throw in there. The little bag latches, grips, and whatnot. The thing I had a problem with these grips and the bars. Handlebar Lee. He just his bars. And I can't get the um, thing on here. Super hard, and I'm not bad mouthing him or none of that. But I've had, I have had difficulties with him, and that's cool. You know, his bike stuff is kind of hectic. Everybody be going through stuff. Everybody be having a lot going on. So you can never expect everything to be perfect. But at least my boy was able to come out with some bars. So they definitely look good. Y'all can check him out. He got some bars too. But yeah, man, y'all see what's going on. This bike, I will be getting some bars from Triple OG, like I did for my last one. I like the uh, bars he had over there on stock in hand, ready to go. So, shout out to my guy for that. But let's see what's going on, man. We about to finish getting this thing going, man. So stay tuned. basically just took off the transmission cover and to do this you got to take this off to get to this clutch line right here that goes up into the handlebar over there so i just assembled that now we do have a lot of fluid you gotta remind yourself you gotta put the training fluid back in there once you're done you got little bolts and stuff at the top you can just push it right up in there but yeah we um we got that off i just disassembled this piece right here it's just a little clip and this part basically cuffs inside of there while this is yanking on there. So what I did was, let me show y'all this other bike. So what I did basically was bend this back like that. 
and push it that way. The only reason why I can't do this one is because you have to loosen up the clutch line right here. So you gotta loosen that up. Once you loosen it up, it'll give you the play you need. But yeah, like I said, we just got this one up off. So now we're gonna finish rotating this 13, no, 14 inch nine by 16 bolt. Twist it off and the line's gonna come out. We're gonna pull it from the bottom and we're gonna put the new one. Now the good thing about the new ones, the new ones are already blacked out and look a lot much better. They are inside of here. So I gotta move these things real quick. But like I said, it's coming. It's looking good. The new lines, this is a brake line right here, as a matter of fact. This is a new single brake line. Top to bottom right here. So we need that. Also, clutch line. Those are the throttle cables. We're gonna put those on after we do the brake and clutch. This is a new one. This part we screw in there. And this is the part for the top that go by the hand control. Right there. So let's swap it out. About to do this real fast. We'll get this thing on the road. I don't know if you guys do but i love the way this bike look right now from the complete bezel being on front now we got the new black brake lines we got the clutch line so everything is blacked out and we got the new windshield on there with the new bars all the way down to the new front rim that he's been having but it's reintroduced with the new single disc so yeah man let me update y'all on this the reason why I don't feel bad, because I have my bike like it, so I rode with it, I've been on the freeway. I'd have been every, doing everything you could almost do with it. So my stopping is cool. The reason why I feel like it's cool because you have the back brake on the right side, then you have the front left brake on this side. So what I'm saying is you have one over here and one up here, so that way if you hit the brake, the bike will balance itself out. Worst case scenario. But on another note, I love how over here you can see it, just how it used to be. But now, when you're on this side, you get nothing but all rim right here. So when the bike is like this one right here, how this bike has the kickstand down, the rotor and the brake is on this side to where you can't see it because the kickstand is down. Now, when you come on this side, it's like a show bike. You got the whole rim, just how this is, but this is a dual disc, so he'll have a rotor. But back to this one right here, Mr. Single Disc, this thing is looking good, man. So that being said, telling you guys man have your creativity do the bike you the way you want it and always just be open-minded man my boy i'm not saying he wasn't open-minded but he definitely listened to me and he liked the outcome he's satisfied i'm satisfied 
We loving it right now, man. So y'all see what's going on, man. This thing is looking good. This thing is on its way, y'all. That single disc looks amazing. So stay tuned, man. We sliding. I see what's going on, man. I'm about to get back to it. This thing is looking good. My light over here dying on me. But um, it's pretty much a wrap. We got everything up on there. When I come back in, I'm gonna go ahead and get the console going. I'm gonna swap that out. I'm waiting on the gas line right here. I wanted to try to give it a start today, but I just thought about it. I can't put no gas in, it's gonna roll out. So we just waiting on that. And then uh, just little stuff like exhaust gaskets. I was gonna put the DND together and throw it on here, but we're waiting on that. So we got some process stuff, man. We got the new brake line on there, clutch line, we got the windshield on this joint. Got the bezel finally bolted, looking good. And most importantly, we got the wheels back. I'm loving that single disc, man. It's like the icing on the cake. But yeah, man, we ain't done yet. We're gonna get it going, get it to the dyno. But before we do that, I will definitely be throwing some blue washers all over this joint. So stay tuned, man. We sliding. Y'all see what's going on. We working, man. Got these bikes coming. I'm trying to get the work in. Every day I can, I'm about to get back on this joint. And if y'all haven't got y'all sliding mask, man, I'm gonna keep telling y'all, go ahead and get y'all one. I wanna come out just how these bikes is, looking good. Your time is now, man. Go ahead and hit the description below. You can be sliding too, man, I'm telling y'all. Y'all could be on the road. So stay tuned, man. We're sliding and we working. Let's see what's going on.